What's going on guys, my name's Connor, and today I have it for you guys on the Louis Vuitton Monogram Gradient T-shirt. I'll be breaking down all the details of this T-shirt as well as trying it on, so if you guys do enjoy this kind of videos, make sure to like, subscribe button, as it really, really does help on my channel and get my videos shown to more people. And while you're at it, make sure to claim your four free stocks on Weeble, like click the link below. All you gotta do is sign up, you get two stocks free, and another two after your first deposit. And also, do not forget to drop a follow on my Instagram and TikTok. My Instagram is gonna be at Connor.Langley. My TikTok is gonna be Langley Luxury. And you guys are more than welcome to reach out to me on those two platforms if you guys are looking to buy or sell anything. But with that said, let's get right into the review. All right guys, so just before I begin unboxing and trying on, there's just a few details I wanna go over. First off being that this t-shirt is gonna be the one with the white monogram and the black overall t-shirt. There's a couple other colors. I believe the only one in stock right now is gonna be the NBA one with the blue and the orange. Um, but like I said, this is gonna be the black and white one. And this one retails at $945 USD. It is completely sold out right now. So if you guys are looking to buy this t-shirt, you can go ahead and contact your rep, maybe call into a store and see if they might have any in stock there. But as far as purchasing online, there is no way of doing so. So you're going to have to buy it second hand. And the resale market is currently somewhere around $900 to $1,000-ish, somewhere around that range. So it is holding its value quite well. And lastly, before I try it on, it's going to fit completely true to size, as you guys will be able to tell once it's on. It began releasing back in 2020, fall, winter of 2020, and it continued being manufactured. It just stays sold out consistently as it's very, very sought after. It's going to be made completely of cotton, and it's also going to be made in Italy. But taking a quick look at the box, you guys can see it will say Louis Vuitton right here. We got the classic sand color all around the box. We're just going to flip it open. It's going to be magnetic towards the front. If you guys don't know, We'll have the receipt right here. I purposely put it on the top because I had someone a few videos ago ask me to show a receipt next time. So here's the receipt right in there. I'm not gonna show you guys my personal information obviously, but there's a receipt cover and you guys can see that there's papers in here. It's not just empty. There you guys go. Um, but here's obviously gonna be the packaging that came with the t-shirt and here is the actual gradient t-shirt. Sorry that it is a little bit creased up. Maybe I didn't fold the best as I was putting it in but it is gonna be in beautiful condition. And you guys can see right at the top, it's gonna to be completely black, even around the collar. And then once you go lower, it's gonna become more and more light, which is something that I love. It's very different than a lot of the other Louis Vuitton t-shirts. They kind of seem to be all around loud monogram, or they tend to be pretty plain with just a logo in the middle. But this is kind of like a combination of both, which is something that I really like. And it also goes with a lot of different outfits. All right guys, this is obviously how it's gonna look when wearing. I'll give you guys a little spin real quick. Here's how it's gonna look from the side, the front, the other side, and even the back. So obviously it is gonna be a pretty loud t-shirt. Obviously anyone that looks at it knows that it's gonna be Louis Vuitton. I personally do really, really like the pattern, um, no matter how loud it tends to be. Um, to be honest with you guys, I felt like the more colored ones, like obviously there was an orange, um, obviously the one right now with the with the orange and the blue, the NBA one. Um, but the, every single other one seemed to be too loud for me, but I don't know what it was about this one. Maybe because it's just black and white where I didn't really feel like any worries that it was going to be too loud. I've been able to pull off this outfit a couple times. I actually posted a picture on my Instagram wearing it um, in LA. Um, and yeah, it's just been a t-shirt that I really, really enjoy. Um, very high quality. Um, and make sure when you guys are watching this t-shirt, if you guys tend to, if you guys actually end up buying it, that you guys are getting it dry clean. And when you guys are getting it dry clean, make sure to do it inside out. Because some of these um, stars and whatever else, whatever you call the pattern, the monogram, some little pieces of it, like the flowers, um, they could possibly peel off depending on how rough you are with the shirt, if you do a lot of rubbing against different surfaces, if you're washing it in a regular washer and not getting it dry cleaned, they will tend to come off or peel off. And even if they don't, they're gonna fade and you're gonna have a less white color, which is gonna take away from the gradient effect, obviously. So if you guys are gonna buy, make sure you take proper precautions and also make sure to keep the box. I always keep it in the box with the packaging and everything. Um, but let me know what you guys think of this t-shirt. Do you guys think that it's worth the $945 price tag? Obviously after tax and shipping, it's gonna come out to a little bit over $1,000 most likely. Do you guys think it's worth it? Do you guys think it's not? 
What's your favorite Louis Vuitton t-shirt? And what could they have done differently with this t-shirt to make it better? Is it just a little bit too loud? Should they have stopped the monogram a little bit lower? Let me know down in the comments. I'm genuinely curious and I love to hear you guys' feedback on my videos. And also let me know what else you guys wanna see on my channel. And if you guys are at this point in the video, make sure to like, subscribe button as it really, really does help out my channel and get my videos shown to more people. And honestly, I'm really trying to get to the point where I can start giving away smaller items. I got a ton of inventory that I'm always holding and I'm pretty much only reviewing for you guys the craziest items that I have. Um, because obviously I don't wanna bore you guys and give you guys stuff that I've already shown or that isn't the most interesting. So make sure to leave a like and subscribe so I can help grow and also start giving away certain items that I have. And also make sure to drop a follow to my Instagram and TikTok. My Instagram is gonna be at Connor.Langley. My TikTok is gonna be Connor Langley Luxury. With that said, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you guys have any questions, obviously leave it down in the comments so I can answer it for everyone. But with that said, I will see you guys in the next video.